Warning, the following game is rated mature and contains content not suitable for younger viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everyone and welcome back to Yakuza 0 Blind. On the last episode, we, uh, are still Majima, chapter 11. Uh, instead of doing some, uh, instead of doing some Cabaret Club stuff, we instead headed over to that side quest that we found. Well, first we decided to go over uh, to the north part of Sotenbori to go get some partnerships made with some businesses. Uh, we weren't able to do anything with the last district, and we only got like half of the ones in the other district because most of them seem to be on the street that the main story quest line is on. So we're just avoiding that for now. Uh, but, like I said, we headed over to that side quest that we found about that drug trial that was going on. We signed up for it despite hesitations. And uh, we're given three different pills to test out. And it just so happened that the reaction we got was the opposite for every single pill. Uh, and in order to test said reaction, we had to beat up a crowd. The same crowd, so, you know, we did it. But, I mean, we successfully got through all three pills and uh, swore off drugs forever. So, you know, we're, we're clean now with 10 million more yen. So, on this episode... Uh, I guess we'll head back over to, we'll head back over to, uh, the club. Now that we're, now that we're here, although, no, 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 we'll head back to the club. Because I'm actually curious now. We have, we don't have half of the fans in the Venus area. But I'm wondering if, I'm wondering what triggers that first thing for the recon. If, uh, if Yuta mentions it, then we'll have it. Uh, we do have the recon available for Mercury, so we'll probably get that done. And then we'll probably do, like, ooh, do we have any secret trainings or special trainings available for anyone? I should check. We'll check. Why are they there? Sorry. I'm just going to ignore them. Hopefully they ignore me. They didn't ignore me. Oop. I got stopped by trash. Oop. Sign still destroyed. So we don't actually know if he's dead or not, right? <laughs> I guess. I guess we'll find out. I mean... Uh, Congratulations, Majima san. We now have more than 1,500 fans from the Club Venus area. Ah, I see. Uh, which one was Club Venus? It's the club owned by Kanahara, that pretty boy who used to be a host. Harry uses his looks to make his girls do whatever he wants them to. Huh? Girls actually fall for that old crap? Who knows? Girls love a good-looking guy. Also, Kanahara is apparently in a relationship with Chika-chan. Club Venus' number one girl. I remember the guy being pretty douchey, but was he that good looking? Can't remember his face. Maybe we should go to Club Venus to take a look. yuta san where do you keep the club's customer data and financial information? Yeah. It's on a shelf in the back office. Hi. Uh, okay. That's next on my list to organize. Who's she? When did we hire a hostess like that? Oh, that's Oishishan. I hired her to do administrative work. She came in with a resume the other day. She's really good at it. So she's been very helpful. Um, <laughs> we should probably be a little careful since they're looking at our financial records. We kind of want to keep those, right? We're adding people to our back office too, huh? Looks like we're really growing. <laughs> Absolutely. Let's keep working towards defeating Club Venus. You're ready to check them out, just say the word. Okay, so we'd have them locked the Club Venus thing. Also, Chica Chan is the name of the hostess at Venus. We don't I don't remember what the name of the hostess was at Club uh at Club Mercury. That's our next target, right? I still have this plate on me that I should go sell. Yeah, Mercury is next. We have Hmm. So fifteen hundred triggered the recon. What'll trigger 
the one-on-one -on -one with the girl. Hostess. Now, let me just check this, see if I have a special training available. I probably do. Psycho is absent today. Okay. I do have special training. Ooh, a disco date with Yuki. Customer service one, customer service one. Well, let's do this now, since we're going to do the recon next. And, you know, then we'll do a run so that we don't waste it, technically. Because I feel like we need to do a special training before we do a run. All right, let's go practice a date. Let's see. Go and practice dating at one of them discos that are sprouting up around here. A, a disco? I don't really, I really don't visit those places, so I'll work hard to learn. Oh, we get to do a dance. Uh, let's just go with normal. I've apparently danced to this song once. Can Kiryu dance to this song? He must be able to. Oh, look at Yuki! Oh, am I dancing against her? Uh-oh. Doing her thing. Oh, sweet. I heard the failure sound effect so many times when I was hitting the button. And I was like, did I just screw up? But I think it was her. It had to be her. I mean, we won. Yay, we won. <laughs> and we got three stars. And I had another point. <laughs> Today's practice was perfect. Did you get the hang of things? Hi. Yes. I didn't know dancing was so fun. I learned a lot. Well, we get to level 20. Ooh. So 20 isn't the highest. Oh God, what's the highest? All right. Let's go check out Club Mercury. Let's, let's see what our next target's gonna be like. All right, let's go over to Mi Mizumara's Club Mercury and check things out. Mizumura. Did we did we describe what who Mizumura was? Because I don't remember who they are. I mean, apparently the the next the Club Venus owner is the pretty boy, but I don't remember what they mentioned about this person. Hmm. We're really going. Huh. Yeah, of course. You want to hang back, Yudachan? Uh, yeah, I think I'll pass. You passed last time. 
Okay. You're acting kind of funny there, Yuta-chan. What's the matter? Well, actually... Majima-san? Oh, you're out. Please go buy some vinegar. What? Vinegar? Can't it wait? No, it can't. I'm making some chirashi. I need, and I need vegan vinegar right now. <sighs> yeah, now that you mentioned it, I thought I smelled some rice cooking. Please, Majima-san. really just need some vinegar. It's a simple request. I'm not spelling that out loud like that. <laughs> <sighs> okay, okay, vinegar, I get it. I'm on my way out. I'll buy some while I'm at it. Sheesh. <laughs> Yay! That's what I'm talking about. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah, way to go, Majima. We totally listened to Yuta there. What's the matter, Yuta-san? Also, thank you, Yuki, for interrupting our conversation. Yeah. No, it's nothing. Maybe he doesn't like Chirashi. I gotta look what Chirashi is now. Okay, it's sushi rice with a bunch of toppings on top of it. Okay. Man, vinegar is sold out everywhere. This rate, Yuki Chan's Chirashi is gonna get cold. Hey, mister. You want a party? Uh, I'm busy. Maybe next time. Why don't you try someone else? Is this our hostess? Or the number one hostess here? Seriously? That's too bad. But you've been wandering around here for a while now. Are you looking for something? Yeah. I need vinegar, but apparently it's on the whole town shopping list because it's sold out everywhere. <laughs> vinegar? Oh, we have some at our club. Oh, yeah? Would you sell me some? <laughs> Come on, I'll give you that for free. All I ask is that you party with me for a bit. Please? <sighs> eh, I guess I got no choice. <laughs> it doesn't sound that bad. It is Club Mercury, though. I guess we got distracted by the... By the... By the ingredient hunt. Well, that drink sure didn't do much for me. But listen, Missy, I gotta get going. Eh? Oh? Seriously. You barely got started, mister. I got someone waiting for me. So, uh... I swear I asked you for something earlier. What was it? <laughs> Come on, I have something for you first. You know what I'm talking about, right? Huh? Eh? You gonna uh, extend your services? Her eyes are up there. Huh? What? No, it's the check. Sir, your total today comes to 100,000 yen. Excuse me? 100,000? All I had was one watered down drink. You mix up the tables or something? It's not a mistake, sir. We charge 100000 at our establishment for that drink. Huh? Are you... That's highway robbery. I ain't giving you that kind of money. That's your stance, sir. We'll have to resort to methods that may be a bit uncomfortable. I will need to convince you to pay your bill. One way or another. I have 99 million? All right, well, if I win the fight, I don't have to pay. That seems fair. I'm surprised I haven't defeated a guy yet. Alright, so Club Mercury is purple by the looks of the thing. Is that host is actually gonna be the the one that we need to recruit, or is it just happenstance that her outfit was purple? I don't know. We didn't learn her name. It was just hostess. I feel like if that was, we would have known what her name was. Do 
She also was in on the grift, so maybe she isn't. Still gonna try to rip me off? No, I wouldn't dream of it. Please forgive me. For crying out loud, how'd I get myself into that? Ah, oh, crap. Forgot all about the vinegar. I'm really gonna catch heck from Yuki-chan now. Hmm? This place. Club Mercury? It's a Mizumura's place from the Five Stars. Darn. So we didn't we didn't see Mizumura or the or the hostess? Unless that was, but we didn't see Mizumura. I'm back. Manjama son, welcome back. Oh man, I sure found some trouble this time. What kind of trouble? <laughs> I beat up hosts. I see. So that's how he runs Club Mercury. Oh. Yeah. So can you clue me in, Yudachan? Tell me about the place. Eh? What? I don't know anything. Don't hide it. You go on mumble mouth whenever someone mentions Club Mercury, Yudachan. What's the big secret? Did he? I did he do this before, or did he like? Because I know he wanted to avoid going somewhere before, but I couldn't remember if that was the recon, or when we first learned about Club Mercury. He didn't join us with the recon when we went to Jupiter, but that's because he was going to get beat up here. <laughs> well, that's... Are we going to get interrupted by Yuki again? I'm trying to beat the five stars here, Yuta-chan. If you know anything, now is the time to tell me. If you don't want to talk about it, I will. Who's that? So this must be the guy. Mizumura-san. I didn't get a chance to take a good look last time. But it seems you have a fine club here, Yuda. Mizumura-san. What happened to you? What changed? Ripping your customers off. You never would have done anything like that before. Mizumura-san, is it too late for you to turn back? You could teach me how to about run a club just like the old tight. Oh, that. Ah. You could teach me more about how to run a club just like in the old days. People change, Yuda. I can't go back to the way things used to be. Is that because you're being threatened? Or because you just chose to do it, and now you're too in too deep. I mean, the last guy was able to flip his switch and be like, Ah, I don't care about the club. <laughs> I'm back to my old self. He's a Murahan from the Five Stars. What's your business here? That you're here just to swap war stories. I just stopped by to thank my customer. Sure he really enjoyed our drinks. Ah. Yeah. Tap water always goes down smooth. Got me nice and hydrated for the exercise I got afterward, too. Little brat. Here's a word of advice I give to hot-blooded young men. Yeah? What's that? Five stars are evil. But going up against evil isn't always the good thing to do. What are you trying to say? If you want to live peacefully in this city... Don't challenge the five stars. Follow my example. You're in the five stars. What example is that? <laughs> exactly. What, ex what example would that be? Uh -huh. Okay, this is the host. Oh, Mizumura-san, here you are. Oh. Hibiki. Uh -huh. It's not safe for you to be walking around here by yourself. I was worried about you, Mizumura-san. Yes, yes, you're right. I'm sorry. Pardon me. I'm sorry for the interruption. Shall we head back? Mm. Yes. Hope I do not need to see you again. Mizumura-san. Well, that was a shocker. I didn't know you and Mizumura used to work together. 
Well, yes. You still don't want to talk about it. When I, when I first got into this industry, Mizumura-san taught me the basics of running a club. I see. Mizumura-san was kind. He was strict at times, but he was always so full of enthusiasm. He taught me so much. There were times when he and I talked all night about our dream of building up Sotenbori's nightlife scene. That's so. I looked up to him. He was my mentor. But now he's one of the five stars, and nothing like he used to be. The old Mizumura-san would never do dirty things like ripping off his own customers. But now... Mizumura-san that I used to work with is gone. I just couldn't accept that, you know? That's why you didn't want to talk about Club Mercury. Fine. Yes. Well, thanks for opening up about it, Yuta-chan. Yeah. No, I should have told you much earlier, Majima-san. <sighs> You're right, you shoulda. <laughs> Look, we're in this for the long haul together. So we gotta be a team. If you're ever having a tough time, let's talk. You know, like if you get beat up or something. Majima-san. Thank you so much. <laughs> Ahem. Majima-san. And you too, Yuta-san. What are you doing just loafing around? <sighs> we were having a heart-to-heart -heart talk here, Yuki-chan. What's so important that you gotta interrupt? Again. <laughs> Vinegar is. I promise you two lovebirds can get right back to it when you give it to me. You did get some for me, right? We really need vinegar. I forgot. <laughs> oh. I like the... I mean, it seemed like he completely forgot the moment he stepped inside Club Mercury. And, like, her saying that was the moment where we are just like... Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's exactly what I needed to do. Oh, the poor dinner! We ruined it! Well, I mean, you could still have rice, I guess. Hibiki is the name of the hostess here. Okay. I mean, wouldn't it tell us in the completion list? Would it tell us here? No, because they, they're not telling us what, uh... Oh, God. Okay, I have to buy more accessories to get more, more of those things done. Complete EQ special training on sub-story. So there are sub-stories for every single hostess we get. Platinum hostess. I want a lot of accessories for Yuki. Not 59%! Sweet! These are so close to being done. Uh, there's got to be more levels of this. Like, there's probably more than five. Once again, one of these times, I just need to, like, return to this game, and that number's going to be absurdly high. <laughs> We're almost the 30 Majima soap stories. Simon the Mystery Man. Who's Simon the Mystery Man? Oh, the Simon Says guy from the phone booth. He's a friendship? I guess we technically haven't finished that quest line, huh? Out of the four karaoke songs, I've only gotten one above 90. <laughs> Alright, hold on. We've done our stakeout. Psycho's still out. What is the... Hold on, let's switch out our hostesses a little bit. 
Yuki's fine. We'll keep her in just because she's not tired right now. This would be a chance to get to get Saki leveled up. God, I have so many level ones. I is a little hurt. You know what? We'll sub you out. Just a. E. We gotta get you leveled up. So if I if I open for business, what's the uh, Mercury long sessions? I backed up completely. Uh, let me let me get the clothing I need to get for Saki now that she's a member. Find out what like what best suit I should get her. Prepare to open. Cause she's all everything but cute. She's everything but beauty. Wonder what we should make you. Whatever it tells us. Let's see. Suggested makeover. Says we just need imported sunglasses, elegant necklace, and red nails. I guess that's it. Oh, okay, cool. So she's everything but cute. What sucks is that these aren't saved per person. These are, I mean, these are... I can only have a certain amount of saved clothing, because these, I think, are both Yuki, and then this is uh, I, and this is Saki's clothing. And I can't name them anything different. Ooh, they're both... Well, okay. If we had someone that had cute... Do we have anyone that has, like, super high cute on the current list? Okay, we do. And that'll help her, too. Very good at party as well. Ooh, so wait. If we're doing, like, long sessions, then everyone needs to have, like, a lot of health, right? Well, everyone but Kyoko has pretty decent health. We'll be fine. Oh, we got a wealthy. Okay, there you go, Yuki. Start it off. I want fans, so I'll give them, like, very elegant. Uh, let's go with... Hold on, let's see. Let's go with Kyoko. She, she wants leveling up. Uh-oh, what happening, what's happening over here? It's Ashtray. It's cruel of you to have both glasses there. Okay, uh, let's go with you. 
I, I want to, I, sh I should, I need to get like the, p the people that are at the bottom of the list table so that they can level up. Although we do need to get Saki one. Well, there we go. Wealthy. Oh. Ooh. He doesn't seem happy. Hold on. Okay, she's a little better. That's guest class. I just I I need to get out of my head. Get out of my head when I when I look at this. Okay, I could have waited a little bit. Okay, I need to get I don't have anyone with love. Ooh, didn't really look through that, huh? Doesn't sound that happy. E. Well, this is my fault. I didn't. I didn't pick anyone with skill. A lot of skill here. Hey, would you like an ex? Okay, more fans. Trouble, all right. Guess left, all right. Sweet. Oh, no, no, no better, no better one there. All right, Kyoko is currently tired. <laughs> Let me get this table going before I activate the next. Mega Rich! Ooh, that's new. Oh, he has very exquisite tastes. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I might need to get Yuki on this table. Let me just put you there. Uh, let's swap you out for that. Oh, look, someone better for you. Oh, Yuki's not good either. Better, I think. Will Yuki... Oh, Yuki might be the best for that. Uh, let's give expensive gift. She's gonna be tired, but... There we go. Decline extension. Alright, well, that's fine. Unsatisfied. Should've gave a gift. She has no health. Here, let's do this. I'm gonna swap her. Oh wait, I did, and she sat back down. No one better. Okay, there we go. They're all happy. Another very rich. Ooh, they're specifically asking for Yuki. I see. No wonder no one's happy. Uh, I only have one Yuki. She's sitting down. She's busy. I'll give you Yuki when she's done with that table. Finish, please. I'm hitting the wrong button. There. No, let me switch. Let me switch. Let me switch. There you go. <laughs> 
Oh, Kyoko is just getting dangerously, da dangerously low. Oh, another mega rich. And I don't have anyone with skill. Oh god, where's my where's my cursor? Everyone's tired. Oh, that was a quick That was a quick turnaround. Five seconds left. Slightly better. She never got to sit down. <laughs> now, despite having several mega rich guests, we didn't grab a lot more money than normal. But Jesus, Yuki. Everyone was asking for her. What's Saki do? She leveled up once. Ugh. How am I ever gonna level you up if you never get a table? I feel so bad. I don't, if we got like, if we had like 80 more, I feel like 3,000 is what we need to hit before we get like the, the interaction with the hostess. <laughs> Never mind. Congratulations, Majima san. We topped 2,000 fans from the Club Mercury area. Ah, huh, right on. Looks like we gotta get some momentum going. Yes, and Mizumura san might be making a move soon. You having second thoughts about going up against the old man, Yuta chan? Honestly, I don't know what I should do. But we can't leave things as they are. Let's... Let's defeat Mizumura-san together. Ah. Right on. Been my plan all along. Hi. Yes. Uh, Majima-san. I think I need some vinegar. Again? Say what? Are you making Chirashi sushi again? Uh. Of course. Thanks to a certain someone, we wound up having a rice ball party last time. Uh, sorry. Ai Chan is helping me this time, so please make sure to pick up some vinegar. Okay, okay. I'll go get some now. We're so not finding any, are we? I look so sad. The heck? Why are they sold out of vinegar everywhere? Ai Chan's gonna be pissed. Wait a minute. Why's the manager of the club gotta run around like a freaking errand boy anyway? Really? You're sold out of vinegar too? Hmm, I know that voice. What am I gonna do? I wanted to make Inari Zushi for Mizumura san. Ain't that a biggie from Club Mercury? Hmm? At least we're not saving her like we had the last couple. Well, I mean, we didn't save. We didn't save Saki. Saki was just coming to warn us. Saki was trying to save us. We saved I from getting, like, attacked. What a coincidence that we're both looking for vinegar. For sure. So you're making Inari Zushi. Sounds tasty. Oh, mine is really delicious. It's Mizumura-san's favorite. Really got a soft spot for the old man, huh? Mizumura-san is so suave and cool, and he understands that I can't work too much, but he still supports me. You can't work that much? Mm. Yeah, I have a much younger brother. I take care of him, so it's difficult for me to work every day. 
kind of get tired pretty easily to begin with. Izumura-san knew I'd have to take a lot of time off and hired me anyway. So I'm really thankful. And I feel indebted to him. Even though you work at a rip-off out of a club? It wasn't always like that. But after his wife passed away, Mizumara-san started gradually changing. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. His wife passed away. That was... Yeah. Uh-huh. I can already understand. <laughs> yeah, about a year ago. Ooh, and it's recent, too. At the time, Mercury wasn't even a cabaret club. Oh, here comes the sad music. Oh. He was a regular cabaret, and Mizumura-san and his wife ran the business together. So when she passed, I imagine it was doubly hard on Mizumura-san. He was determined to run the cabaret by himself somehow. But it didn't go so well. Ooh. <laughs> so now he feels like he failed her in multiple ways, huh? Running a club like that alone, and at his age, must have been really tough. Yeah. But right around that time, Club Moon Sukiyama invited him to join the Five Stars. If you ask me, converting the cabaret to a cabaret club was something Sukiyama-san made him do. Mizumura-san seemed really sad when that happened. Ever since then, though, he'll do anything. He's followed all the Five Stars' orders without question. Right down to scamming the customers. He's been through a lot. Even after all that, I... I felt I had to stay by his side. I haven't been able to re I haven't been able to repay my debt to Mizumura-san. You sure it's okay to tell me all that? I'm Club Mercury's competition, after all. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Maybe I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> that was a heck of a soliloquy, then. Maybe you can free Mizumura-san from the Five Stars Curse. Mm hmm. Hmm. You say something? <laughs> Nothing at all. Well. Thanks for sharing. Don't mention it. I'll see you around, Majima Kun. Ah. Yeah. Well, now I feel bad. But, I mean, if taking him down, like, frees him from, like, the chokehold that, uh, the chokehold that the Five Stars has on him, maybe he'll be like, I can. I could be at peace. It's pretty late. Guess guess we, we were talking for a while there. You still don't have vinegar, do you? Mizumura-san, what you're doing is wrong! Uh -huh. hmm? Oh, why is he back? <sighs> I can't be choosy about my methods to achieve my goals. You will understand this one day, Yuda. It's not something I ever want to understand! Mizumura-san, I will stop you, no matter what! Even if it means I have to defeat you. Oh, now he looks so sad. <laughs> uh, you sound like you've grown a pair, son. Fine. Come at me with all you got. I've sold my soul to the five stars. I've poured my life into Club Mercury. Let's see if you can take me down with your dreams and idealism. I will win! I'll beat you and show you how wrong you are! He wants to be beaten. All right, Yuda. I'm looking forward to the next time we meet. Hi. Definitely. Yuda-chan. Uh, hey, Majima-san. Welcome back. You've been gone a while. All right, let's get this club ready for the show. Let's hop to it. Come on now. Chop, chop. Can't keep our customers waiting, you know. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Let's do this. Hi. For sure. Oh, oh Majima-san. The vinegar? You got it for me this time, right? I totally forgot. <laughs> All right, well... Way to make this guy's backstory so super tragic. But, I mean, we have to take him down. He's our next target. So, 
ooh, but we don't have enough fans in Club Mercury yet. And it might take us another run-through. Or two. I think it'll take us at least two run-throughs, because we're going to get, like, 700 fans per, if we, if we do, like, the same kind of thing we've been doing. And we're, we're like, 13, 1,400 away. So. On the next episode of Yak is a Zero Blind. I got the hiccups now. Uh, we will probably do some more runs of the club just to get our fan base up in Club Mercury. And maybe, and we'll do some more special training. I don't know how many more special trainings we have with Yuki before we, like... Do we have to do all of the special trainings before we get their sub-quest? Because how do we get their sub-quest? Hmm. We'll find out. So, until next time. Hopefully you enjoy. Hopefully you enjoy.